Brent Tech here, where tech is made simple. So as I have been posting previously, Microsoft is slowly starting to integrate OpenAI's artificial intelligence chatbot called ChatGPT into their newly redesigned Bing search engine, which will at the end of the day basically enable you to have conversations with a chatbot. Now, as I did post last week, um, Microsoft was sending out an invitation to sign up uh, to join a waiting list uh, where you could try out the new chat GPT with the new Bing search. And just to let you know, um, if you haven't noticed already, that um, recently over the last day or so, I received this email, uh, which is now available on both my devices. You're in. Welcome to the new Bing. So now I've moved from the waiting list and I can now actually try out the new chat GPT powered Bing um, chatbot which is now rolling out to early testers and one thing to take note of though uh, if you do receive this email Microsoft says they don't have a mobile experience ready yet and are actively working on it and will have it ready soon so just take note of that chat GPT not available on mobile devices as yet now um, if you did join the waiting list previously if you went over and clicked on chat uh, this would just tell you that you were on the waiting list or ask you to sign up to the waiting list and as you can see now I have um, early access and are one of those early testers now um, as mentioned previously chat GPT can be used for various tasks so here we see a couple of um, examples ask complex complex questions get better answers get creative inspiration and basically at the end of the day um, it is suggested though that chat GPT will basically replace your so-called traditional or normal search engines. And um, if you want some more info regarding ChatGPT and also Google's equivalent called Bot, then just do a search on uh, the channel as I have posted some videos previously. Now, one thing to take note of, it's still early days. So um, Microsoft does say uh, Bing is powered by AR, artificial intelligence, so surprises and mistakes are possible. And they also note that... Um, if you do try to ask the chatbot unethical and dishonest questions, it's not going to give you any response and give you any answers. So just one or two things to take note of. Now, as mentioned, um, this is an invite-only um, an invite only early access version, which means only select users have access to the service as yet. And uh, um, just to show you more or less how this will all work, I'm just going to ask the chatbot a very simple question how old are you just to give you a brief example hit enter there's the question how old are you and there we go hello this is bing i don't have a specific age but i was launched in 2009 as a rebranding of microsoft's previous search engines so you could say i'm about 14 years old in human terms and then yeah we can see some secondary questions pertaining to our relevant search and at this stage uh, this just looks like a very souped up so so to speak um, version of Cortana and I have posted previously that Microsoft could be integrating chat GPT more in depth uh, into Cortana in the future and over and above this uh, being available now in Bing search and if you are not seeing it, by the way, just be patient as I'm sure you'll get it sooner or later as Microsoft is starting to make it more widely available. Um, something else to take note of, if we just head over to Edge Canary, which is a preview version, something else that's uh, making its way to the stable version. If we head over to Discover, yeah, we can see the chat GPT is now integrated into the Discover site panel, which is basically the exact same thing that I've just shown you in the stable version. And uh, yeah, you can compose. So you can uh, compose the tone, the format, the length. Uh, you can have a preview. And so this is just another indication that there are more features going to be rolling out to the stable version of Edge regarding ChatGPT, which will also be eventually made available in the site panel. So uh, if you haven't noticed yet, go check out your inbox or just head over to Bing Search and see if you've received the email and as mentioned on a controlled rollout and becoming more widely available uh, the new Bing search engine with the chat GPT integration. So thanks for watching and I will see you in the next one.